Uh, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I would like uh, to introduce uh, the work we've done on wood identifications of West African objects conserved in French museums. Of course, we will do a very quickly review because West Africa and West African objects are a quite vast subject. Important trees in a sculpture is too big also. You will see uh, some images of uh, proto uh, web page site and inside wood, so to remain this morning. Um, the history of the African continent is complex and, as you know, it has been influenced by foreigner nations. We'll see today only an overview of the countries that experience the French presence or those whose objects can be found in French museums. Sorry for the images. Maybe you can replace them? Because uh, many of us, we are able to determine uh, some of the species about color, density, and so on. But with, when are working with antiquities who uh, ca carried with him the weight of the years, this is less easy. I found that we need to observe uh, the wood under the microscope. Here you can have my colleague, Catherine Lavier, which is taking some examples from an anatomical study and the radiocarbon analysis. You can see here the alteration of the color and density of the sculpture. The market for um, African art in Europe now, nowadays a very significant increase and the arrival of fakes in the market is very important. For that, at this moment, museums and um, particulars are asking for scientific analysis. One of the most asking is uh, wood identification. In order to identify a species, we need to observe the distribution and the size of cells who compose the wood structure. We observe the wood under the microscope on these three plans, uh, transverse, tangential, and radial. Objects we will see uh, mostly come from the Quai Branly Museum and the Louvre Museum in Paris. The vegetation in West Africa is extremely rich and varied and need a specialist knowing well the flora and the specifically wood anatomy. So, except some objects uh, I identified, the most important part of the work was done by Pierre Detienne on the Reciage Forest in Cirad in Montpellier. Uh, you will see we have uh, only objects uh, from the 17th uh, century and after because they, we have no uh, objects before who conserve in this kind of humid uh, conditions. The first object we will see come from the Republic of Guinea-Bissau on the Bisagos Islands. The Bisagos Islands are a group of 77 islands of islets located in the uh, Atlantic Ocean. There is a high diversity of ecosystems, mangroves with intertidal zones, palm forest and semi-dry forest, savanna, uh, aquatic zone, etc. The local ethnic group is known as the Bidiogo. Due to difficulties of communication with mainland Guinea-Bissau that persists to this day, the population has a considerable degree of uh, autonomy and uh, he has shielded his ancestral culture from outside influence. The Bisagos people produce many artifacts for daily use and ritual following a traditional iconography that is unique in this culture. Um, among the most striking Bidogo art pieces are the portable ancestor shrine and the zoomorphic mask. They believe that after dying, the soul can only find peace of a statue uh, is carved in which it can rest. This ancestor statue is made on Santo Xilom, the Senegal prickly ash, a shrub of a small tree, a spiny, up to 12 meters. The timber is yellow, very hard and termite resistant, and is used for building purpose, including poles and posts. It also makes a very good firewood. The wood can be used in cabinet work, also the pieces are usually uh, small. The bark of young branches contain much resin, which makes them very suitable for ceremonial torches. 
throughout West Africa, the aromatic roots, steam barks, and leaves are commonly used in traditional medicine, and he also has um, a magical religious uses, including protection against spirits. It serves as a fetish plant. Um, my literature is, uh, oh, sorry, yes. Present day uh, Republic of Mali once owns part of the three West African empire that control trans-Saharian uh, trade, the Ghana, the Mali, and the Songhai empire. The earliest of these empires was the Ghana empire, which was dominated by Soninke, among the speaking people. The empire later declined as a result of internal uh, intrigue, ultimately being supplanted by the Songhai Empire from northeast uh, Nigeria. Mali territories encompasses uh, three natural zones, the southern cultivated uh, Sudanese zone, central semi-arid Sahelian, and northern and Saharan zone. The Bandiagara Escarpment is a land inhabited today by the Dogon people. Before the Dogon, the escarpment was occupied by Telem and Toloi. Many structures, especially the granaries, uh, remain for the Telem. The cliff constitutes a natural area of unique and exceptional beauty in West Africa and is covered typically by Sudanian savanna. The wood of this uh, statue is the wild, wild syringa, a medium-sized uh, tree up to 20 meters tall. The wood of Rukea is mainly used locally and trade in limited volume internationally. Also, the wood is very hard, but it's not difficult to sew. It's difficult to work with hand tools. It takes a nice polishing uh, when it's finished. The wood is used for many uh, purposes, poles, parquet, flooring, furniture, railway, stencils, tools, etc. And the bark, roots, and leaves are commonly used also in traditional medicine. Burke Africana is a true multipurpose tree, not only important for its timber, but also a source of medicine, firewood, dye, and edible caterpillars. The Telem were uh, pygmies or small people who built dwellings around the base of the escarpments as well as directly into the cliff. As I say, some of uh, the Telem buildings, especially the granaries, are still used today by the Dogon. The Telem people have disappeared for the area uh, by assimilis assimilization into Dogon culture or some unknown reasons. It is thought by uh, some in Mali today that the Telem possess uh, the power of flight. Ficus toningi is an evergreen tree. You can see this um, uh, quite old sculpture before 17. Um, it is a tree with a creamy uh, brown wood, uh, quite uniform structure, light, soft to moderately, and is finished uh, smoothly and holds nice firmly. Its durability is low uh, and is uh, easily attacked by uh, termites. The bark is an important source of local medicine and we use, you, we use also the uh, tree for fiber. The Soninke are Amande people who descend from the Bafur. Uh, they were the founders of the ancient empire of Ghana. The sculpture represented a mythical ancestor, Nono, and is made of the wood of Aphelia Africana, a small to very large tree up to 40 meters tall. The wood is characterized by an excellent stability and a good uh, natural durability, even for use in permanent human conditions. It makes an excellent wood for use in crafts as well as interior fitting. It has been used traditionally for canoes and domestic articles such as boxes, bowls, spoons, mortars, and masks. In many regions, Atfelia africana is one of the most important woody fodder plants and used also in traditional medicine. Formerly called the Republic of Upper Volta, 
The country was renamed Burkina Faso in 1984. Burkina Faso from Mori may be translated as land of upright people or land of honest people. What is now central Busi, uh, Burkina Faso was principally occupied by Mossi kingdoms. It is made of two major types of countryside. The large part of the country is covered by pain plain, which form a gentle undulation landscapes, with in some areas a few isolated hills. The southern of the country forms a sandstone massif. Approximately 15% uh, of the country has forest cover while wooded land. This statue is one of the very few no works on this style. The ritual destination of this sculpture remains unknown. The Nuna are a population from southern Burkina Faso. Their wooden statues are held by men called Buru, which control of a bush spirit. Most large effigies have their feet broken, uh, indicating that they were planted in a ground in a place determined and fixed. She is made in a Vitex uh, Doniana. The West Africa, African plum wood is popular for house building, furniture, stalls, carving, ta -ta -ta, toys or boxes. The hair wood is creamy, white to pale brown, uh, yellowish brown or grayish brown. And the grain is uh, straight. They are said that the wood resembles uh, teak. In Burkina Faso, Vitex doniana is one of the most uh, highly valued species by the population, especially a source of construction timber, edible fruits, and leaves to make a vegetable sauce. He has also a numerous applications in medicine. Prior to its colonization by Europeans, Ivory Coast was home to several states including Guayna Man, the Kong Empire, and the Baule. Ivory Coast is formed by a large plateau rising gradually from sea level in the south. The southern region, especially the southwest, is covered by dense tropical moist forest. The Baule create art in several different media, including gold and brass casting, wooden sculptures, masks, and figure. These two objects are made of Funtumia elastica, a medium-sized tree. It is a species of dense evergreen forest which also grows in the coastal zone. The tree is especially known for its medical properties. The wood, creamy and light, are almost used in local carpentry. The Federal Republic of Nigeria has a very varied landscape. The far south is defined by a tropical rainforest climate. The forest zone, most southerly portion, is defined as salt water swamp, also known as mangrove swamp. Everything in between the far south and the north south is savanna. The three largest and most influential ethnic groups in Nigeria are the Hausa, Igbo, and Yoruba. The Yoruba kingdoms, especially the kingdom of Benin, were located in southwestern Nigeria and became preeminent in 12 to 14 uh, centuries. You can see here a very beautiful uh, head of king made in Cassia Siberiana. The wood is suitable for make furniture, tools, construction, and rival slippers. It's also used at firewood, but is considered inferior because it produces a lot of uh, smoke. The roadwood is used in Sierra Leona and Burkina Faso at chew sticks. The termite resistant wood changed from white to yellow, yellowish pinky to dark red upon exposure. It is finally texture, heavy, hard, and difficult to work. The West African laburnum is, is a shrub of a small tree up to 20 meters tall. The leaves, roots, and pods of Cassia Siberiana are widely used in traditional medicine. The root and seeds are used also as a fish poison in uh, um, Ivory Coast and Nigeria. Milicia Excelsa is widely used in tra African traditional medicine also 
and is often considered a sacred tree and frequently uh, protected near houses and in cultivated fields. In Benin, the foliage is used as a fetish, and in Nigeria, the tree has a special place in the folklore and tradition of the people, as we can see here in this mother and child, uh, child statue. Iroko is a highly valued commercial timber in Africa, from which demand is large. The tree can reach up to 50 meters high, and is used for construction work, shipbuilding, and marine carpentry framework, outdoor or indoor joinery, stars, garden furniture, cabinet work, and so on. It is also used for carving, domestic utensils, musical instruments, and toys. The hardwood is pale yellow to yellow, darkening on exposure to yellowish or greenish brown, or sometimes to chocolate brown. Also, the hardwood is generally considered very durable. The Republic of Cameroon is called for the tourist Africa in miniature for its geological and cultural diversity. Natural features include beach, deserts, mountains, rainforest, and savannas. Early inhabitants of the territory included the Sao civilization around Lake Chad and the Baca hunter gatherers on the southern rainforest. The wood of Cordia Mileni is mainly used locally and has no importance in the international trade, but the wood resembles some grades to African mahogany, kaya, and entendofragma, and in, it has been exported as a substitute. <clears throat> the hardwood is pale brown, medium brown, occasionally pale purplish of pinkish, and not very uh, demarked from the uh, sabot. Uh, it is uh, used for construction, joinery, interior trim, paneling, furniture, musical instruments, including drums, boxes, toy utensils, tool handles, canals, and carving. The Gold Coast Bombax <coughs> is a large tropical tree that can grow up to 40 meters. The wood is quite light, which limits its use to canoes and other implements. <coughs> Sorry. A dye can be made from the tannins with the, with the bark, while the cotton-like fiber that covers the seeds is gathered and used as a cotton substitute. Both the flowers and the fruits are used in food. Many parts of the plant are used uh, for medicinal and traditional uh, purposes. The bark is born to produce a smoke that is believed to drive away evil spirits called alizini in Dagbani. And uh, red gum produced from the tree is used as incense. The earliest inhabitants of the Gabonese Republic were the Pygmy peoples. They were largely replaced and absorbed by uh, Bantu tribes. Gabon generally has an equatorial climate with an extensive system of rainforests covering 85% uh, of the country. There are three distinctive regions, the coastal plain, the mountains, and the savanna in the east. Gabon also features internationally uh, celebrated masks such as uh, the Engoltang Fang and the reliquary figures of the Kota. Each group has its own seat of mask used for various reasons. They are mostly used in a traditional ceremonies such as marriage, births, and funerals. Traditionalists mainly work with local woods and other precious materials. This one is made in Ricinodendron eudeloti, a medium-sized tree up to uh, 40 meters. The wood, called erimado, or uh, essesang in trade, is very light, soft, and perishable, but is occasionally used in carving and for making household utensils, furniture, boxes, and crates. It is a potential substitute for balsa, for making floats and life belts. Uh, the hard ore is uh, whitish to pale yellow and is not differentiated from the sub wood. The wood uh, works easily, but uh, turning and planning are difficult. 
The Republic of the Congo was dominated by Bantu-speaking tribes who built trade links uh, leading into the Congo River Basin. The southeast of the country is a coastal plain, and the interior of the country consists uh, of a central plateau between two basins to the south and north. Forests are under increasing exploitation pressure. The earliest uh, inhabitants of the region were also the Pygmy people, who later uh, were largely de displaced and absorbed by Bantu-speaking peoples. The Bakongo are a Bantu ethnicity that also occupied part of present-day uh, Angola, Gabon, and Democratic Republic of the Congo. This uh, Bitege sculpture are made in Imenocardia acida, a small savanna tree or shrub about nine meters high. The sahood is ivory white and the hardwood pink to light brown darkening to orange on exposure. The wood is hard, uh, close grain, very durable and termite resistant. Used for uh, hot poles, stockage and for making pestles and mallets. The trees use also firewood and for charcoal making and he has a medicinal properties. The Democratic Republic of the Congo is the most biodiverse African country, the second largest country in Africa and the 11th largest in the world. The ecoregion contains areas of permanent flooding swamp forest, seasonally flood, flooded swamp forest and flooded grassland. This reliquary from the MBD people are made in Seiba Pentandra. The tree has two main uses, being an important source of fiber and timber. The wood is creamy white, streaked with yellow, brown, pink, and or gray, but this coloration due to fungal attacks is very common. The dry wood is stable in service, making it ideal for plywood core stock. The wood is difficult to sew, cleaning, and finishes smoothly. He has very low durability. Traditionally, entire trunks are hollowed um, out as uh, dugout canoes, and the wood is used for lightweight uh, furniture, utensils, container, musical instruments, mortar, mortars, carving, and similar items. Seba Pentandra finds uh, wide application in cooking and in traditional medicine. I just show you a little overview of objects and trees typical of some regions. Of course, there are other trees with sacred characters and thousands of objects attended proper identification. As I told you, the market for African art uh, is um, very important in Europe now. So when a museum wants to uh, buy a new artwork or want to study his own, he requires identification and more and more uh, radiocarbon. Here you can see a sampling of some objects uh, placed more or less in uh, their geographical area. The objects came from uh, uh, Branly Museum. Uh, on the left, you have the supposed uh, chronology, started uh, by sickle, uh, of the objects, and on the right, the results obtained by the carbon 14 and the interpretation of Madame Lavier. As you can see, the chronological distribution data changed considerably and will be a promising field uh, investigation. I would like to uh, thank and express my sincere admiration to Pierre de Tienne, which is an extraordinary wood anatomist, as many of you know. I also want to express my gratitude to the International uh, Wood Culture Society for all the work that they've done. And uh, it only reminds me to thank all of you for your passion and your attention. Thank you very much.